actually one of my teammates on the side said, hey, you should ask her her occupation. And I was like, you know, I'm thinking it's going to be something with mechanics or something with computers, something cool. And so when I found out, I was just like, oh, well, this is really interesting. So I started asking her questions. But then, like, eventually I got it out of her and, she, like, that was, she was a priest. And I was like, wait, I've never met someone who was, like, religious, but also, like, interesting and liberal. It kind of, like, opened my eyes up to that. And I think it's cool that we have a priest. It's like a guardian angel for the devils. It, it, it works. I got into roller derby because I moved to a new city and needed friends and needed a hobby. And I found them on Facebook. And I thought, oh, I used to skate as a kid. I should try that. And when I got here, I found a community of people that really love each other and care about each other. Everyone is always welcome within the Derby community. And it seems that when I've talked to her about the church, it's almost like that same culture. It's all inclusive, all loving, no attitudes, uh, no bias, no discrimination. Come in, we're here for you. If you need an assistance or a shoulder to cry on, we're there. If you have needs, if you have issues, we're here to help. So it's a perfect fit. I found it really refreshing to be around people that teach me how to be better as a human being and help me understand what the church ought to be like in a lot of ways. Spyro is what we call her. Uh, she's a pretty unique individual, but the team is made up of a lot of individuals. <laughs> I feel like Spyro has kind of uh, just been there as a quiet um, but strong um, force of love and I really appreciate that and I respect that. I, I love it. Like I know like with Spyro, every time I have a conversation with her, I can just see and feel the calmness from her and feel the, the, the sweetness and, the, and, and you know, some innocence and <laughs> naive, you know thought-provoking kind of conversations that we have, but it makes me a, a stronger blocker and a teammate just because this is somebody who I really care about who plays with me. Like, we, we play this really intense sport. Um, it's insanely fun, but also, like, can be stressful at times, and roughing each other up, but also having good sportsmanships. Having her on the derby team, she's a really strong player, a great teammate, and we kind of build each other up, and it's really great. And when I told church people about the fact that some of the girls cleaned another girl's house while she's on vacation. They were like, oh, it's a great idea. We should do that. Um, we should start doing that. I said, yeah, absolutely. Like, they're really good at loving each other. And I think that's what we're called to do in the church. And so it's a really beautiful thing. I think it's, um, I think it's really cool that we have all the people we have from all different walks of life, beliefs, and um, occupations. <laughs> We're all different, you know, we all have different kind of mindsets, but it still is so beautiful to bring so many different people with different backgrounds together, so. I would say it just brings a lot of people into her path that maybe she wouldn't meet on a regular day, you know, doing her job.